So, uh, you think it's glamorous to be in the Hollywood lifestyle, right? Think it's all glitz and glamour and everything is going to be alright if you become a Hollywood movie star, right? I can tell you right now, I am a Hollywood movie star. And it ain't no walk in the park. It ain't no picnic. It ain't no... No, you putting in work. Hard work. Sometimes you walk in 30, 40, 50 miles when you get put in your first official film. Barefoot, walking on glass, you know, uh, defecating and urinating outdoors when all you want is a bathroom. Living homeless two, two to four to ten years because they filmed some bullshit like the movie called Life, like the one that we all up in right now. They're taking clips, film, photo, everything. I'm working my ass off. I, I get maybe about four to six hours of sleep and then I'm out there acting again. And then I'm putting shit on YouTube, giving the movie life more inspiration. Let me tell you, then you start getting flack from your siblings that are Hollywood or other Hollywooders giving you flack on their Facebook page. So you think they're talking shit. They fuck with your head. Hollywood does. All right. And that, that ain't, that ain't dogging on Hollywood. No, they got to catch you in your natural game state. They keep you safe and protected from everything, but they get you in your natural game state. That natural game state ain't no fucking picnic. Trust me, it hurts. You're a lot of tears. You're a lot of emotion. Yeah, when a Hollywood movie star cries in the film, it ain't them faking it. Hell no. It, they literally put them through that much intense stress and arrest. I'm not bullshit. You don't want to be Hollywood. If you ain't one of us, you don't want to be one of us. You thinking it's all cute and cool and cute to put your kids in like TV commercials and shit? That shit ain't cool. What the fuck you doing to your kid? You want them to grow up fucked up? My sister fucked up on drugs and shit. Not my mom, my sister. My mom was smarter. My mom in Hollywood, she was smarter than my stupid, dumb, cunt sister, Jennifer. Yeah, Jennifer, I just called you a cunt. Not my mom, Jennifer Banco. Not her. Not my auntie, Jennifer Banco. Not her. No, my bitch sister. Come down here and meet me in California. Grab me Naomi Banco's house, Beverly Hills. So I go down there. She's sitting in a dress like this that's got one strap. All right. Jennifer, sis. You know what blew it? You leaned it into the table and you put your breasts on. As soon as I saw you, you it, boom. No, we're just friends. All right, you should have known what Carol did to me, sis. Come back to me. You're the love of my life. I need you. I need you. You need me, sis. Grandma Fox and Grandma Banco anointed. Are you stupid? Are you aware how much money Grandma Fox and Grandma Banco put into their church collections plate for us to be a couple? Dude, if Auntie Charlotte finds out, a dude, Auntie Charlotte will stomp your ass. Crystal finds out, she'll kill ya. Not literally. She'll rip you up one side and down the other. Saying she was just nine, you were 19. What the fuck's the matter with you? Do not ever piss Crystal the fuck off. Trust me, she goes off more of a firecracker than I am right now. Grab you, boom, slam you against the wall. She don't give a shit who you are. She's about 250, 300 pounds, half chocolate. Because we're all mulattoes. Mm hmm? I use the term mulatto because you know what? I am. Kurt Cobain said it. An albino, my mulatto, my mosquito, my libido, yeah. Notice I have Kurt Cobain's voice. Notice I have a Jamaican voice. Mm hmm? Jennifer, I know you into pure chocolate. Guess what? 
an ultra milk chocolate, ultra white milk chocolate. I've got a little bit of black in me. I got a little bit of Jamaican in me, Latino, uh, Korean, Japanese, I think. No, not Japanese, Chinese. And I have a little bit of uh, Middle Eastern in me with a lot of European. Those maybe British. You want to throw? You want to throw this away? You know what? You want to throw this away? Plant a fish. That's all I gotta say. It's all about planting fish in the sea. But if you're Irish and you can't pop a lid like that, then you ain't. You ain't Irish if you can't pop a tip top like that with your teeth. So sis, kiss me I'm Irish. I'm a part of a lot of religious groups, Illuminati schools and bones, uh, Jamaican posse. And uh, I was thinking of one in a brain fart. Um, Skulls and Bones, Illuminati, Jamaican Posse, Military. Yep. yep, I'm with the most reputable of all the organizations. By the way, Navy Shields, toughen me up a little bit and let me join your platoon. I'm an operative mercenary sniper. I will walk into a combat zone and I will, there's no cheat. I'm like a spy for the US military. Wait a second, here Osama bin on. Get over here. My sister dressed in, in military gear. Get over here. Get over here now or I have to drop you, you're a terrorist. I walk over to her all scared like that. She goes, extend your hand and expect anything, and I do mean anything, and do it now. <laughs> Shake my hand. Good. Salute me. Welcome to, or thank you, or something. She said something like that. She saluted me. She military, and she saluted a civilian. You know why? I ain't no civilian. I'm a military kid. The turn, I think, military. Yeah, I got the respect, but you got the respect for me, Jennifer? Or are you just going to walk out of my life and say, no, she fucked up when she was nine. I ain't going to forget her. I ain't going to do the Christian thing. Show a man's nothing. Are you going to be like that, really? Are you that high and fucked up on drugs? Was Carol really right about you, Jennifer? Are you where I was over at Carol's house? Jennifer don't love me. Jennifer hates me. Jennifer don't love me. She knows everything to me. And I'm starting to scratch. My mom comes over very gently. Carol never does this. She came over very gently. Put her hand over my hand. Said, it's okay. Stop. Carol actually comforted me for the first time ever the other day. She talked with me. She got the mom in scoop. I'm crying. Grandma Fox dead. Grandma Fox dead. I miss Grammy Naomi. Now I'm trying to gear up again. Grammy Naomi, I'm here for you, Michael. It's Naomi. I'm here for you. Grandma, I need you. Mom, Jennifer Baco, I need you. Sissy, I need you. I need you help. You just gonna let me sit there and die? Sissy, I need you to check my body for razor blade and cut marks. I don't trust anybody else. Everybody gets nasty with me because they want Alyssa Milano. My mommy, Alyssa Milano, is tattooed on the back of my neck. I 
and you do show up in courtroom 260 on the 9th Let the judge know all my issues Then know we film in Hollywood film life. Tell him acquit me. Tell him acquit me. Gigi, I need you. You are the love of my life. I didn't realize it. I'm sorry. <laughs> anyway, you can stop being mean to me. Come out and see me. I'm worthy of it. I will never walk away from you. I don't track you down. I don't stalk you. I don't track you down. I go away and well, she just hates me. I think you hate me. If we were growing, growing up together, you probably would have beat me in shit. That's the way I feel. Dizzy, come back, be with me. Show me you love me. If we don't give it, I don't care about it. I just want to spend time with you. Dizzy, why are you mean to me? I love you. I would do anything for you. You're my sissy. And mama, if you tell me to do something, I do it. I don't question you. Sissy Grandma, she's comforting me. Oh no, this ain't no bill. Don't get it twisted. It's a monster juice. And I'll give you my favorite one. Look, look at this morning. The voodoo can. I love it. This was created by Jamaica. I love this. Mm -hmm. I love my ways. I'm a white Jamaican. What part of that do you not understand? Jamaican respected by everybody. Nobody hates a Jamaican. They're respected by everybody. Same thing with Asian. Those two races respected by everybody. One Racism by mistake, the other by choice. So, this is my secret. Be, you gonna make all my dreams come true? Be back together with me, Jesse. You wear the pants in the family. I step down from that. You come back to me. You wear the pants in the family. Do this. What did I, what did I say? What? What? Yes? Say yes ma'am. Yes ma'am. That's how I be with you sissy. You be the dominant, I'm the submissive. Just don't take it to a nasty degree. You be nice to me as a dominant. I never had that before. I want that. You tell me when to put out, you tell me when to take shower, you tell me when to eat. You tell me what to eat. Don't eat the nasty foods. Yeah, sour cream, mayonnaise, milk, wood, cottage cheese, cucumber, zucchini, ranch, nasty. That reminds me of the male plumbing. It is nasty.